Hey guys, welcome back to another vlog. Today I'm at Jitex 2022 and it's been three years since I came to Jitex. Jitex is the largest technology show that happens in the Middle East. They have the latest in consumer technology, development, startups, all that kind of cool stuff, high-end stuff for the metaverse and things like that. I just thought I'd take you with me and show you the best of Jitex 2022. It's been a couple of years since I came here, so I'm very happy to be here again. Check this out, there's a robot making art right behind me. So this year, they have a full exhibition just for developers, which is awesome to see. Being, being a tech guy myself, it's really nice to see that they have this kind of thing over here. So they have a hackathon going on. This is called Dev Slam. So I'm just going to go check out what some of these devs have been up to. All right, guys, here we've got a look at a new flying taxi concept. Looks amazing. I mean, like the quality of this thing. So they actually did a live test of this vehicle uh, in Dubai, and that's what this video is about over here. But uh, pretty cool stuff. This is going to be in action soon, in a couple of years. Looking forward to uh, checking that out. This is the Hisense ULED 8K. And this thing looks absolutely incredible. It is a lot always has the craziest stall and they have the most interesting stuff happening over here. So let's go check it out. It already looks incredible. This is a robot that's going to charge your electric car. So we have a couple more flying car concepts over here. This one is like a uh, octocopter, eight rotors. And this one's a quad copter configuration. This is the next generation of the Dubai police vehicles. It looks like an upgraded Nissan Patrol. But it's very cool. All right, guys, so this over here is the new HTC Flex. It's a portable VR headset from uh, similar to the Oculus Quest 2, I guess. So um, it's supposed to be portable and uh, the controller. This is the controller for it. It's got an inbuilt speaker. It looks interesting though, and, uh, with the glasses and all that. So they've got cameras in the front. It does inside out tracking. Uh, it folds, which is pretty cool. And they've got speakers over here with adjustable focal distance. Pretty cool device. I think the Oculus Quest has some catching up to do. Quite an interesting product, uh, HTC uh, Flex. But it doesn't have its own battery, so you have to power it with a battery bank. The resolution is about 3.2K, which is not amazing uh, I think the quest was a little bit better but interesting product it looked, it seems really portable all right guys this is the hololens 2 right this is the new one yeah. so first time I'm trying it it's augmented reality glass from Microsoft and I'm actually moving like 3d virtual objects right now with my fingers oh yeah right. There okay. are some person with the devices and some person with the So I can see what she's seeing? This one. See. You see this one and she is show this one. Okay. And I can zoom. So this is the new HoloLens. And if you look over here, there is a, a layer of glass that projects holograms into your eyes. It's actually way lighter than I expected. And the quality of the hologram is really good. 
but everything is done with tracking, with hand tracking inside. And the tracking wasn't like perfect, but uh, really cool experience. The first time I'm seeing augmented holograms that way in the HoloLens. It's supposed to be one of the best currently available. Pretty cool tech. They are in Germany right now. You, oh, really? You can speak with them. Hello. Yes. Okay, so this is some new virtual conferencing technology I'm checking out. It's built on the Cry engine? Yeah, uh, no, it's uh, built not on the Cry engine. It's a totally new engine. It's a new it's, engine. It's a completely new engine built from the ground, but from the from the uh, uh, God, from the father of the Cry engine. Ah, uh, okay. One of the founders is from the Cry. Yes. Yeah, so okay. The founder is from Crytek. Former okay. Crytek uh, founder. Okay, nice and CEO, so uh, he built uh, now the most powerful engine for the web. After he built the most powerful engine for the game. Okay. Yeah. And uh, yeah, Is this can... all browser based? Exactly. Okay. Just one click, no installation needed, nothing. It's okay. all running on browser and it's rendered all in browser. You see real-time reflection, yeah. uh, retracing, we have everything in it and okay. it's still browser based and it looks photorealistic. Mm. And you can also have a more more stuff and uh, shares and uh, it runs actually better than uh, Zoom and uh, Microsoft Teams in Dubai. And you can yeah. and you can you know it's interactive. You, you can place every kind of item in yeah. it, be interactive, mm -hmm. and then share it with everybody. Alright, guys, that's it from Jitex. Another cool year, some really awesome technology, and I'm glad that they've included more like Def Slam and Metaverse kind of stuff at the event. It was really nice to see. Anyway guys, that's it for the video. If you liked it, hit that like button, leave me a comment, subscribe to watch more videos like this, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.